We know that with cold emails, we see now people speak about open rates above, uh, you know, 40%. What with lending, uh, it's hard. It's hard to, um, you want to, if you're above 20, 30%, that's really good. And, you know, we're able to do that. And the reason we were able to do that is the segmentation of the audience. But I want to say something about that segmentation. Uh, a very common mistake, I think, is segmenting the audience based on your products. And this is, again, listening to ourselves and not to them. We're like, that's our product. I'm going to segment everything everyone based on the product, based on, is it business equipment, equipment lending or, or SBA loans? These are, the, no, these are not necessarily the segments because these people, what they have in mind is their business. If you're able to understand where they are, what sectors they serve, what are their pain points really, I think that the segmentation is way more uh, effective. So in this case, we just broke it down to their sectors and we really made a lot of research to understand what are the pain points in each sector. And I was trying to think as a business owner, say, if I I have some farm midwest somewhere you know what what do i have in mind you know what what do i want to listen to what kind of email would i open that kind of segmentation really led to great performance get a great return on investment uh, for this lender and just i think it's a good example of how good communication good segmentation can really be efficient mm-hmm.